Hi guys! Okay, well, obviously I'm in a different setting. You guys can see, like, my entire bedroom, and it's probably a little bit distracting. Because you have Marilyn Monroe over here looking at my dresser, my TV, and everything that I have on there. And then all this chaos in the background right there. It's pretty crazy. If it's too distracting, let me know. Is it a thumbs up or a thumbs down? I like my bedroom, so I like this background, but... I, don't, I can understand where it'd be super distracting. Okay, so anyway, <laughs> today I'm going to be doing this eye for you. Um, it's just like a pretty, um, like a natural brown sort of looking eye. Just brown colors and neutrals, and I think it's really pretty just to wear either every day or you can even wear it out because it's sort of smoky to wear out too. Okay, well this is look number three. I think on my little smoky eye series. I think I did black, I did gray. Yep, this is my third one. So I really, really like this one. I wear this one a lot, actually. So um, I hope you guys like it. And if you want to learn how to do it, just keep watching. Thank you. The first thing you're going to do is prime your eye. And I'm using Urban Decay and Sin. I like to use this color for um, like more brown-based colors. And... For like other colors like black or just regular other random colors other than brown, I'll use my other Too Faced one. Because this one's sort of um, shimmery and brown, if you can see that. It's a really pretty color. Like I think you could use this just as like just anything. Like I think you could just wear this and put on some mascara and you'd be set to go. <laughs> so just put this all over the lid and bring it under. Okay, so this whole look is going to be done on this Natural Eye Too Faced. I love this thing. It's I think it was like $35. I got it for Christmas, so it was a gift, but I love this. It has these colors in it, and it has a little brush, which I haven't even used. It still has the plastic on it, but <laughs> whatever. And um, we're going to be using this top row. So you're going to take a big, fat blending brush, and I'm going to take this gray color. And you're just going to put that all over the lid. Bring it up on the brow bone. Okay, then we're going to take this really like white color. It's more like a creamy color. It looks white on here, but it's cream. And do your highlight. Do your inner corner. And I like to put it right here right on top like where my pupil is and that's just gonna add a pretty highlight I don't know if you guys can see that but it just looks like pretty okay then we're gonna take the brown color right over here and first we're just gonna start it right in our crease And then you can slowly start pushing it downward. And we're just making a semi like outer V shape right now. But we're just making it really blendy and soft. Okay, and then I'm going to take this um, crease brush and dip it right in that brown. And actually make the outer V. And so basically what you want to do is just go from like where your crease starts and all the way down so like there's a line right here see it pretty much just follows that line and so then you're, F, you're just gonna push the color in towards your eye just to make it blend a little bit better then we're gonna take the blending brush again and just soften up that outer edge just a little bit so it isn't so harsh and scary And you want to make sure they're even on both sides so it doesn't look weird or anything. I'm going to add a little bit more cream right here and just to lighten it up a little bit. Alright, and then you're going to use um, an eyeliner. I'm just using an eye pencil. This is Sephora and this color is... What is it? Coffee. So just a really nice brown color. You guys can't really see it. And we're just going to line 
the, your top eye, or your your top eye, <laughs> the, your eyelash line. You can make it as thick as you want it, as thin as you want it. Mine's going to have a little wing to it. You're always going to want to set the color, especially when it's hot out. So I just put that pencil on my eye. And so I just have this Coastal Sense palette, and I'm going to use this color, which is a really dark brown. I obviously really, really like it because it's almost gone. And you're just going to um, take an angle brush like this and dip it in that color. And then just go right over that line. And this is just going to set the color so it stays all day. Alright, and then you're going to curl your lashes. And put mascara on. Okay, now while we're waiting for our lashes to dry, I usually go ahead and do my eyebrows. If you guys didn't notice, I only have one eyebrow done right now. And I look like a freak. But... That's going to be fixed. So again, I just used my Coastal Sense palette, and the colors that I use are just a mixture to match what color I want. So I use that dark brown color, this like light bright, light gray brown color, <laughs> then these two colors up here. These two. I just like using just regular eyeshadow. I think it looks... um more real with the bristles and the eyeshadow the way it places on your eye or on your skin it just looks more like real hair it doesn't look so much like you colored it in rather than looks like you just maybe filled them in but obviously I have to color in my entire eyebrow okay so I'll probably make them a little bit thicker Okay, so after you let your um, eyelashes dry, then you're just going to take that brown pencil again and do your waterline. Okay, and again you're going to want to set it so it stays longer. It's really hot and humid here, so I always want to set all my cream and gels and pencils. And also, I forgot, you're going to want to take that crease brush again, take this palette and take just that brown color that we were using, and just smudge it a little bit underneath, and that's going to make it have a little bit more smoky effect. Just like that. Okay, and this is your brown smoky like natural type of eye. I really like this eye. I think you can wear it either out or you can just wear it every day. Um, I think it's really pretty and it's just natural but sort of smoky at the same time. And I hope you guys like it. Thank you for watching. Bye!